Hi all, this is Master Munch and welcome to episode 43 of our Shogun 2 Total War Portugal campaign, playing on Legendary. And the war continues on both fronts, we are fighting everyone and just for the sake of just keeping it uh, as the same we're doing, just with quick check of the map so we can see exactly who we are fighting, where our enemies are. We finally found the Shogun in the past few episodes. That is still surviving, but barely. Hatakayama have taken a hit from us. Uh, our ally, the Satake, have kind of grown. The Satomi are still the same. Tokugawa almost gone. The Tsutsui seem to be the major threat at the moment. And Yamana uh, are our allies. We it can't ask them to, to be our vassal because they're our Come. allies. And Never we don't stop. get the, the allies points for the victory. Which we're not that far, I believe. To win, we do need, we need 17 more provinces. That does sound a lot, but it will reach a point that after we break, the majority of the armies will just continue taking. And it, it does show that we have 21 of one own and we 23. So the vassals do count, but the allies don't. So we need to keep with that. Let's just check our family. Ooh, everyone is so loyal. Absolutely love this. Hell yeah, incorruptible. How is your son? Dependable. Eh, you're dependable. And Daimo is distinguished. Mwah. Delicious. Um, my god. Agent, Agent Galar here. We are, we are pumping up. Oh. You are... You are very leveled up. Who are you? Soggy set. Not a game. War without blood. One cunning, one overseeing armies. That would be very good, but we don't need to worry about that. They will do as I say, uh, Kumicho. They will do as I say, my lord, and we will profit by it. Hmm. Yeah, that makes more sense. This is cunning, counter spying, overseeing towns, bribing. That's what we want. Uh, apprehending. Cunning, no, yeah, and we also want this. Actually, let's do a bit of a semi-equal. I do want better bribing, but because there's so many agents right here, apprehending would be the best show. Do we have any? Like, are you upgraded? No, you still have the same clothes. Because they do upgrade, uh, obviously. Our master ninja is right here, I believe. No, where is our master ninja? They're here. Yeah, they are on the way. On the why can uh oh, this makes it a bit weird. Uh, we do have this little fleet. I, uh, we don't have caravels with cannons around, but oh, I, I haven't learned. But these two should be enough for the altar resolve to deal with this. Come on, yeah, no, that's perfect. All right, all right, that worked. That worked. Let's just pull you back. This is a military fleet that I'm bringing somewhere. This guy needs to go back. We are trying to sort out a bit <laughs> of our ship maintenance because everything's very all over the place. Oh, we have two cannons that I m caravels that I might have moved. And we will. Well, we can bring another uh, punishing force to our galleons because the galleons are here in this bay area and we found a good force of Tsutsui ships actually so we can bring that to reinforce uh, we do have a galleon somewhere I think it's here it's being fixed so we can bring that we have plenty of armies here after our push against the Hatakayama we finally found Kyoto we even got a full army which is delicious this is our Sebastian Torres our best uh, Missionary in the northern theater we do have our leader a general and our son and I am, the plan is to use this guy to come here and see what they can do. Can we demoralize character conversion? F 53, actually. Let's see what that goes. Uh, that's all right. Unless he didn't die or anything. Because it would be cool if we get a general, wouldn't it? Yeah, it would. Um, nah, it's all right. Can't recruit any soldiers. We do have a bit of... Yeah, we do have a couple units that we bribe um, we still don't want to push inland here because that would be too difficult to defend however 
I do feel like <laughs> we can finally uh, start thinking about conquering Kaga just to really clear this area and uh, Noto will be protected hopefully Echo and Kaga will protect this battle, the, this tip of the bay area which would just be nice Echigo is like a, what is it now? You're a castle, that's like the highest we have a good garrison there regardless so we can even maybe start thinking about taking that army from that um, we, we'll still leave like the merchants because again guys we do have a very uh, cap on units all around every single one has a cap for us so we do need to be uh, wary or where we deploy our limited forces but this army is coming here we are ooh, we are in autumn we're gonna get attrition but we're gonna have to attack we'll see if we fight or we just auto resolve because there are more important fights i believe and one of them i know i keep saying that we don't want to really push here but we we need to now that we secure this sea region and uh this area should be safe so what i will do is move you guys come here and that should be a relatively easy auto resolve. We can continue siege. And what I will do is move some troops unless... No, you, you get pissy. I, I, am I? No, uh, that's why you get pissy. Actually, let's do this to the majority of provinces that we haven't done. Because we do not need the money for now. If we ever become in a place where, yeah, we need money, we'll start taxing everyone. And this is just a fail safe because we don't need it. So having everyone exempt from tax just means that if we're ever in a trouble situation, we don't really need to do anything else bar just unclicking it and see how bad the public order situation is, which shouldn't be that much. So let's just check now that I don't, I made you guys not pay taxes. Are you still? Nah, yeah, you are. And since ah, that's because. And since we actually are going to go for a siege battle, um, more halberdiers is always the answer. There you go, another one. And that uh, will be fine. We can even try to push Kyoto with these three armies, but that might be a bit of a stretch because Kyoto had such a large army and as soon as we take Kyoto everyone would just gun ho for us so we we're not in a bad position for that but we might want to wait a bit more before we start doing stuff and we since we can almost no we can almost reach it can really reach Kaga in one turn and next turn is winter anyway so we'll wait one turn and we'll leave them there we don't have any soldiers here is this all merchant all merchants yeah, Leonard Souls already fought a couple battles here. Okay, so I guess we, I guess we can. It's been a little bit, so let's fight a, a siege battle. <laughs> These siege battles. If I didn't fight it, it would be just ex such a zero losses. But we need, we need some excitement. So let's go. We have this. I'm gonna just turn on the fan. It shouldn't be too hard. We'll we'll lose soldiers because you know. Me with a siege battles is still something I need to get better, but we're getting there. And we need the coverings and actually need to check how far. We're still researching for the foot knights, I believe. Yeah, so we're still a bit far off from getting the better cannons that actually will do a lot of destruction. Because these bombards, they are an artillery piece, and that's all right, but it doesn't have the destruction power that we need. And we only can have six of them, and we're dividing between two armies, I believe, three and three. Which is also like the, the artillery pieces are the ones that we most clearly and keenly can feel the limits of the caps because we can only have six of each 12 in total let's just watch our army in a little bit because i do like the, these little videos oh man this is a big castle should just auto resolve god damn it <laughs> Where 
は米俵に閉じ込められたネズミのようなもの。逃げ場はない。自らの血で溺れさせてやるのじゃ。今日の敵は武士の誇りのかけらもない奴ら。野心生まれて、蔑まれながら死ぬ。奴らの腐った屍は恥という名の棺桶で葬られる。命令はただ一つ。この城を落とすことじゃ。Alright, sorry about I moved the headset a little bit. Okay,、uh, those archery towers are a pain. In the but, and we don't have that many. We can, we can try a different strategy for once, and that will be attacking one side. Since we actually don't have that much of a large army,、uh, it needs to be on the hill, I do believe. Here shall be fine for our bombard so they can destroy. The tower and bombard this area. We'll have our arquebusiers to deal with their archers because they do have archers. And because of that, we have five halberdiers now. It's a good number. Plus two pikemen will、we'll、do the job as、uh, just. Just、uh, wanted to say, let's just put you guys like this so you can even like move freely without worrying. Just like melee troops, that's what I was trying to say. And English came out of my head really fast. So just let you guys, the general, right behind the gun pieces, and we'll start. I want you guys to clearly destroy this.、Uh, you guys don't have a very clear and light of sight. That is alright. Move a bit forward. You also move forward.、Mm, okay. They're doing thinning here. So we'll bombard this and then we'll attack this.、Uh, your. How. These bloody towers, man. They're super powerful. You forget, like, everyone complains about. Ooh, nice. Everyone complains about the Warhammer towers. You forget the Shogun 2 towers were actually really, really good. Or at least I did. That was a good hit. Let's just watch it get destroyed. Oh, how are you in the process of loading? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Get out of the way. Nice. Oh,、wow, that was super close, I guess. That was a cool little destruction. Now they're moving below. Smash them, and now our gunpowder troops can go forward with no impunity. And we do not need to worry. I mean, at least still l o o t like this. We do not want to be in a line of sight for our cannons, which will still bombard them. And these guys can just volley. A glorious victory will soon well, the battle hasn't barely started, man, so chill your beans. Why can't you fire? There's literally fire there. There's nothing for you. To not be able to fire. Yeah, look at this. Alright, we are. Yeah, there you go. Destroy this and keep firing with the muskets. They are not getting close. Do they have archers here to shoot above us? No, they don't. So, this is all infantry. So, we should really be careful of how we assault this. You can see what. Nice. That was perfect. Now you three do the same thing here. Look at that. So we need to shoot against the walls, not the units. I am very stupid. There you go. The archers are essentially gone here. This Yari Yumi Ashigaru. That, 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 yeah, that destruction was, was solid. And、uh, the, the arquebusiers and the musketeers are doing a lot of damage. We are already successfully destroying that wall. Yes, we are. Look at this. I have just been retarded. Sorry about the use of the word. About how to use my artillery pieces. It's just hit the walls. 
you fucking idiot. So there you go, another little jump there. Let's just keep bombarding them. Because there's no necessarily any rush for us to attack them. Ooh, do you... Uh, shoot them. They're getting, they're getting to somewhere that they shouldn't. Really? Do you guys need to walk? Why do you need to walk? Fine. As long as you don't do anything too stupid. You still destroying this wall? I believe so. Why don't I see any damage here, boys? Come on. And are you guys still walking like idiots? You are still walking like idiots. So, hmm, the spirit of not wanting my soldiers to die, let's form them like this. And it's still very clear, hopefully. And keep firing. Oh, now they moved. They are relatively smart. The cannons are still trying to... Yeah, there you go, they are hitting the walls now. Will be another bombard and they will blow up again. The archers are still here, but they're still getting shot at, which is fantastic. You guys can clearly see there. They are wavering, but it's still there, 40 of them. And how about this, there you go. Nice. So these guys are feeling the pain. Oh, you're unprotected now. Musketeers, can you fire against them? Do you really need to walk? I don't think you need to walk. Just fire against them. The cannons can still do that because they have not reached close. Alright. We will start moving our archbasir or halberdiers. And we are moving them like so. We will. Mmm, that's still relatively safe. Let's get the uh, help for uh, pikemen there. You guys stop right there. Ooh, nice. Okay, this is fine. Can you guys hit them by any chance? That would be interesting. Let's see. Are you running? Ooh, don't run, don't run, don't run. Don't run, don't run. You guys are... You guys have such heavy armor that that is a bit of a detriment. Just enjoy a bit of the smoke. Pikemen going forward. Muscatiers. The Muscatiers are getting shot at. Look at them, all hiding. Really cool. Uh, general, the cannons right behind. Loading. All the smoke. Oh, wow, they're shooting there. Interesting. That's not what I told you to shoot. I don't think you guys can shoot there, but that's okay. If we tell you to shoot here, for example, maybe you will hit them by mistake or accident. Are you guys not shooting against them? There's 86 there. So actually, let's tell one to keep shooting here. Perfect. How are our halberdiers? Are they? They're already winded, and they just did that. You guys are fresh. Okay, cool. Because we are gonna kind of like rush this position, so it's gonna be a bit tougher than usually is. We can even send some pikemen here because they're more disposable. Because they a lot will fall. Like the heart, obviously, the higher it is, the more it will fall to their deaths. Which is really annoying. Uh, are they hitting? Are you guys doing what I told you to do? I'm trying to hit here and maybe hitting them. Nice! Nice, that was beautiful. Keep doing that. Whatever cannon is doing that. Mm. We will win this, obviously, but I do want these guys. Oh, you're active. Winded, active, that's fair enough, but see, no, like we dealt with their uh, limited, their limited range infantry, so that should be fine. 
let's keep walking you forward because then one will go here another will go here one will actually no, let's go this like one will burn the state actually let's let's send you because these are the pikemen so they are more disposable we are not losing soldiers uh nice this is wavering what are you? okay we don't need you guys to keep firing so just stop for a second because no there is no one yeah on the walls look at this destruction <laughs> you shitty archers okay how are you guys now ready who's getting shot at why are you getting shot ah these guys all right then everyone just up here. These will destroy the gate and get some damage in the process, but that is quite alright. Oh, it's been the ca ah, the cannons, yeah. So, alright, we bombarded the crap out of them as much as we can. Uh, the musketeers will be the ones. Are you? Did you run out of ammunition too? Why are you not letting me... Oh, you did run out of ammunition. The Arquebusiers have it. Oh, nice. We still have some cannonballs left. Is this completely burnt? This is completely burnt. So we actually will do for a little bit. We'll form a pike wall right there. So we can do the first real proper events that we had. Like, we had so many siege battles. But so far we have really been doing it not in the best way but now we have no rush and we do want to take this with minimal losses because pushing forward is of utmost imp utmost importance that's importance to ice in the same sentence for english all right they are moving closer and closer we are waiting they are active so they'll still get like tired and what we'll we'll do we'll move we can't move you guys we'll move you all here I'm gonna even move my general around this area actually no general is gonna be here because do not want to be shot by my own cannons you guys can't fire anymore so let's actually send one of you here and keep firing against them everyone is ready for the push so let's do it bringing you up bringing you to this wall bringing you to this wall no, actually, stay here. I want you to this wall. I want you in this wall. You in that wall. And you in this wall. Alright. So, yeah, they also, they, these guys are gonna die before... A lot of them will die before we even reach there. And they should be safe from this. This is just to get these guys attended to them. I would risk our gunpowder troops. Are they fleeing? No. I just so want them to actually go down here and face like directly our pikes. These guys are thinking, okay, we're finally reaching at the top here. We can stop the cannons just for safety. And nice. Oh no, you f idiots. You're going on the long way. But the majority is going in this little square, which are already taking the walls. And as cowards, they are fleeing. So we will push forward. I know, here they are fighting. But these are halberdiers against swordmen, so... Oh, look at this. This is actually quite cool in this little pocket. These retainers were the brave ones. And then there's some squabbles here. Oh, against the retainers. The Yari Garrison. Just, oh, they're all fleeing up. They're all fleeing up, and we only send one pikeman up. So this is slightly concerning. Hmm... Oh nice, we still have one of these, so yeah, go like from the, from the entrance. I'm glad we are bringing, we brought you guys up, because if they take the walls, it will be a bit tougher. These, these pikemen, I don't know, this is, yeah, yeah, no, they'll be fine, regardless of how tired they are. They are already fighting. Ooh, I was just going to say, I hope these are going to win, and they are, but this guy is tech. Taking the walls against this tiny garrison is taking a bit longer, but we have so many battles to fight, so it doesn't really matter. Alright, 
Mm -hmm. They are holding there, but we will break them soon enough in a very orderly fashion. What we can do is simply break the, the pipe formation so we can just rush in. Yeah, look at this. Breaking them away. Charging from all directions. And they are broken. That is perfect. Let's bring all of you. Again, we should not rush. Let's do this properly. Because if we just if we just attack, we'll lose more men than we need. But these guys desperately need our help, so we can't just dilly dally. So you guys go straight in, as do you. And all of you attack these. These guys actually no. You go here. The rest can do that. Look at that. Scale those walls. Come on, boys. Didn't use the pikeman for with the, the pike formation. That's all right. Look at this proper attack. How is this pikeman doing? Oh, they're still holding actually. Very impressive. Now with the pikes down. But they are doing a big distraction. Oh, nice. Hobbiteers are coming in. Perfect. That is what we wanted. They are holding us here, but we are sending more soldiers up the walls. So that should be relatively okay. Oh, the fighting is right here, and these guys don't care. They're just climbing. Okay. They are wavering because I think they are feeling our attack from here. These pikemen are. Respect to those pikemen and these hobbiteers. Look at this. And the shade and everything. This is all crappy infantry, so we should be able to break them when we have enough soldiers up. These guys are still... As soon as we break them, as soon as we can start flooding in with more soldiers. Climb these. Come on. Yeah, we are bringing more and more soldiers up and we're not getting hammered with arrows which is beautiful i learned my lessons in previous siege battles do take the towers out first obviously that's siege battle 101 but uh i can be stupid <laughs> so let's see how everything's going here did i give you my whole firm you already used your whole firm and you are holding very much firm not even using your pikes Good thing you're just fighting like crappy units. All right, we are starting to break them all. How is this thing here? They're still holding. No, they broke. Charging. You, you can still fire. The rest, charge inside. Oh, nice. Now we actually have a force here. Look at this. Sadly, oh no, this is Tsutsui. I oh, still have to kill the Christian rebels. I forgot which garrison we were attacking. <laughs> Obviously, they are. Have you seen how much fighting they have been doing? How are these guys here? Why have you not pushed forward on? Because these guys are right in front of you, I guess. Just kill them. And you are charging them. It takes these spike when respect them. They held everyone together until we could bring our forces. And now look at this storming. The Tsutsui have a white flag, so it's kind of difficult to see uh, our soldiers from them from up. That's all right. And this is like a crappy garrison, guys. Siege battles are complicated for me, at least. If you guys can do a better job, which I believe you can, honestly not that hard <laughs> yes we know we know let's bring you guys in general here just to give a final push not that we that we need it because this is they're just fighting with stubbornness we are gonna lose quite a few soldiers but i'm not the auto resolve oh all right 
charge them. What the hell is wrong with you? We're, we're trying to bring all the soldiers together. And you're refusing to kill, like, the final guys that are stopping everyone from going in. Yeah, there you go. Now they'll have no chance. Sandwich. Death sandwich. Look at that. They are sadly fighting to the death. Oh, see, we even start pushing them here. Yeah, they are gone. Dead. Let's just grab it. Final push, boys. Final push. Come on. Ah. Just throw the hobby gear. The hobby gear. Down. Summer everything is so annoying. They actually are good units. Man. They already are kind of shit, but they do have a good melee defense, so... Do we need to take the... I think we just... I'm just, again, being stupid and I didn't take the territory. The men are fatigued, my lord! And some must rest! Of course they are. There you go. Another territory... Territory taken. We have... Push forward successfully, ladies and gents. Oh, sorry. We'll see what else we need to do. This was just a uh, big uh, initial push from the south. And then we need to see what, oh, all the other things that we need to do. So much. There you go. Yeah, actually, this wasn't too bad. Honestly, getting better. Ooh, these pike. Yeah, those are the pikemen, the MVPs of this one. So there you go. Let's peacefully occupy. We have Yamato. Hey, One Piece. If you guys are fan of One Piece, you you know why I said that. Fortified. Uh, what else can we get here? Just because we're Christian, so we don't care. Ooh, ooh, another. We can use these. What? Ooh, a good thing I. Nah, this 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 army will hold that fairly well, regardless. We found another Hatakayama full stack, maybe one of the last ones. So we do not want to move this army away. Yeah, a lot. Still a lot of fighting. A bit push southern, southwards. Like we we're starting to consolidate this area properly, so we can go in and do real damage. There, yeah, there you go. We're pushing here. Once we have a better hold here, we can attack Kyoto, because right now we're still very much everywhere. And we hold in the north with plans to take Kaga. Why are the Dati not doing anything useless? The Yamana, right? And we're gonna take this province from Christian rebels as well. Four turns. Alrighty then. So there you guys. There you go, guys. Uh, thank you very much for watching episode 43. We finally been able to begin the southern push, not just in the defensive way. But there you go. Thank you very much for watching this episode. Hope you all enjoyed, and see you guys next time.